At the 2022 LSU Invitational, the 18-year-old phenom Arian Knighton laced up for his very first 200-meter race of this 2022 season. Now last year, the 17-year-old Knighton broke Usain Bolt's World Youth and World Junior Records in the 200, hitting a time of 19.84 in last year's Olympic trials. And even though this time made this teenager an international superstar, he just did something so ridiculous that it makes 19.84 look like nothing. After a fair start in this 200, Knighton immediately took the lead, and by the halfway point, this man was gone. He was on a mission, even against a very talented field, which included various athletes who had already broken the 20 second barrier. Knighton was in a completely different dimension during this race. And with an astounding time of 19.49 seconds, he not only obliterated his own world junior record, but he also just became the fourth fastest 200 athlete of all time. Absolutely unbelievable. Now, the only athletes who have ever run faster than Knighton include Michael Johnson, Johan Blake, and none other than Usain Bolt, which is insane considering that Knighton is still only 18. We have legitimately never ever seen a sprinter quite like Arian Knighton. Before this kid arrived on the international scene last year, only one other junior athlete had ever broken the 20 second mark, and that athlete was of course Usain Bolt. Back in 2004, he ran a time of 19.93, which is still an amazing performance for a junior, but this 19.49 is next level speed, and honestly, it makes Knighton not just the favorite for this year's world championships in the 200, but it makes him the clear favorite to attack the current world record of Usain Bolt, which stands at 19.19 seconds, which is significantly faster than 19.49, but Knighton is improving with such speed that this just might be possible over the next few years. With this single performance, Arian Knighton has shook the entire foundation of the 200 meters. Before today, only three athletes had ever broken 19.5, but now you gotta make room for one more, because Knighton is clearly here to stay. Compared to his own previous junior record, which stood at 19.84 seconds, Knighton just made a huge improvement with this race at 1.78%. Now, this is certainly a big jump in junior world record running, but if we compare his new time to the second-placed athlete Usain Bolt, his improvement compared to Bolt's 19.93 is a massive 2.23%, which places Knighton's abilities as a junior at a very elite level. The last time any athlete broke the 19.5 second barrier was both Usain Bolt and Johan Blake in the 2012 Olympic Games. And I'll bet that if you asked anyone at the time who the next athlete would be to break 19.5, there would be no one to select an 18 year old. Finishing in second was none other than Joseph von Belay, who had a very impressive time of 19.92, which coincidentally ties him to the 100th of a second, with Matthew Bowling as the NCAA leader right now. From my personal perspective, this 19.49 is the greatest athletics performance that we have seen thus far in 2022, and honestly, it is not even close with incredible opening power and some of the best sprinting endurance I have ever seen. Knighton is clearly ready to run even faster this season considering that this was a season opener. And given that the world junior record in the 100 was also set today by Letsile Tabogo from Botswana, April 30th of 2022 just might be the greatest overall track day that we've had in 2022 as well. I gotta say, out of all the athletes we've seen over the previous decade, Knighton certainly has the best shot at becoming the next legitimate Usain Bolt. Whether or not this means he'll become a 200 meter specialist, or perhaps even become a world class 100 or 400 meter athlete, remains to be seen. But either way, this race was absolutely amazing, and I cannot wait to see how fast he will run later this year. Thanks for watching, everyone. And as always, Arian Knighton is an absolute beast.